Hey, what's going on? This is Glendon Cameron with the first session of Disruptive Money. What's going on, people of the internet? That's right, it's Glendon. I'm back. What, what's going on, Brad? Because I know you're out there. All right, let's jump into it. Since I am a disruptive dude, I thought let's just be disruptive all of the way. So what I'm going to do is start accepting Bitcoin, guns, gold, silver, and certain electronic items as forms of payment, barter, or exchange. Because this is something I've talked about all, and I've actually done it before, but on a much smaller level amongst other storage auction people. And I was like, why not? I'm always trying stuff. So let me get into why I did this. Years ago, I had a situation like Erica Badu. I had a situation and I had to get something, but I didn't have any cash. I had no cash, no money in the bank, no credit cards, nothing. But I did have something of value. So I went knocking on doors, knocking on doors, talking to people. And after about 15 no's, I got finally a yes. And I was able to secure the things that I needed. And I thought, hmm, how many of you out there want to take my courses who may have a gun laying around that you really don't care about? Or in the case of a lot of people, a lot of people give people guns. And I was like, hmm, may not have the cash, may not have the credit, but they may have the gun. Or they may have the gold. Or they may have the silver. And I'll just get into how we're going to do this. Number one with the guns, because there's, first of all, all of the internet experts of legality will show up. Well, Glendon, you can't have people send you guns. And I would say... Internet legality, bitches. Yes, I can. This is how you'll do it. You'll find a federal firearms license dealer in your neck of the woods. And you'll go to that dealer and you're like, hey, dealer, there's this guy I want to ship a gun to in Georgia. And that guy's like, OK, well, we need to know where we need to ship it, which also has to be a federal firearms license dealer. So what happens is these two licensed entities ship the guns to each other and there is a fee on both ends. So. That's how you can legally, for the people of the internet who will come in and like, there's no way. And also for you fools, you can ship interstate and check your state laws, but you can do it in Georgia. If I want to send Brad a shotgun and send it through the United States Postal Service, I could legally. Look it up. Don't believe me because there's most of you like, you can't do that. You can't do that. Oh, I'm just a scared little bitch. And people like you will always go ahead and just assume the worst versus exploring the concepts for yourself. So that's what's happening. The Bitcoin will be set up probably sometime tomorrow. And I'll make an announcement or I'll put a link under the video. So it'll be like now accepting Bitcoin. Blah, blah, you go here and do this. Now, let's talk about the gold and the silver. My preference is coins. If you have gold coins, awesome. However, once again, since I have dealt with loose gold, if it's chains, earrings, hoops, whatever. Now, let's talk about thresholds. Bitcoin, whatever. You know, once I get that set up, you can buy anything that I'm selling, uh, even exchanging kind. So no problem with that. Gold. Uh, once again, I'm going to put the threshold at 50 bucks. You get a 50 buck credit because it's really not worth your, well, yeah, 25. Make it 25 because Gold is a wonderful thing. Silver, uh, $25 worth of silver. So essentially, it's not a lot in gold and silver. Now, how do you send it to me and how, how do we make sure that everything's on the up and up? What you're going to do, especially if you're an eBay person, you halfway know this. Whatever you send me, take a picture of it. And also, there's going to be a procedure before you even send it to me. You're going to take a picture of it and you're going to send that picture to Amy and we're going to hash out the details of value. And then once we all come to agreement, then at that point, you're going to ship it. You're going to ship it with a tracking number. You're going to ship it uh, trackable mail. And let's just go ahead and say, since we're dealing with high you know, value items, we're going to ship it pretty fast. All things you can do, you can ship 
pretty much several houses of gold or silver through the United States Postal Service priority mail, 11, maybe 12 bucks with tracking number. So that's how we're going to do it. And also what I'm going to do is pay for the shipping. So what that means is whatever you send me, you can deduct the shipping off or I'll add an additional credit to whatever you send me. Also that works with the guns. Now the guns, the threshold is 400 bucks. Now this is the thing. When you send guns through a dealer to another dealer, the transfer charge is $30 or maybe more depending, you know, you have to check with your dealer and it's going to be on both sides. So say it's $30, well, it's 50, say it's 50 bucks. So it's a hundred dollars. So it doesn't make sense for you to pay transfer fees of 20% on a $400 gun. So typically what I'm going to do, the threshold is let's make it 500, 500, 550 for the guns. Because, you know, and I'll tell you, I like Glocks, I like Smith and Wessons, I like Coats. So once again, you send a picture of what you have, and then we'll work that out. And then once we come to terms, then you ship it. Not before. So do not just start like sending me some stuff. Hey Glendon, I sent you XY. No, 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 no. No, Consuela. No, no, no. We're not we know. No. It doesn't work that way. Does not work that way. So that's how you're gonna do it. And once I put this together, I think it's going to be pretty interesting because there's another thing. And so, oh yeah, for you folks out there who are on the money orders, I will now accept United States postal money orders. Yep. If you want to pay me by money order, because there's a bunch of folks who don't believe in debit cards. There's a bunch of folks who don't believe in credit cards. And there's some folks who are going, oh, Glendon, I've been waiting on this. So we're going to get completely in the disruptive economy now also another thing i'm going to add up to this it for your storage charging guys you're going to love this because i just you know i was going around and i actually found some bullets i bought out of a unit all these came out of one unit these are like some 380 rounds and i remember this guy and the guns yes the guns were in the unit 357 i've had these bullets so long there's oxidation well these, yeah these are the hollow points these are the uh, good ones. And why am I showing you ammo? Because I will accept ammo. Yep, shotgun shells. But it's got to be like bulk. I'm not going to take, uh, unless it's an expensive box. Like years ago, this box was 16 bucks. So maybe five cases of ammo. Be about 100 bucks. You know, especially this is 357 hollow point. These are, uh, if I remember, these had some kick because there was two boxes of these. Then, oh man. Yeah, these are, I think these were really good. Don't remember. But as you can see, I shot quite a few of those. You got those. And, oh. <laughs> oh, oh. All right. Some more hollow point 357s. All right. So what I'm going to do, and I want you to hear me out. Cause I'm gonna make a deal with you. I'm gonna make a good deal. A good deal. It's gonna be so good. Whoever wants to be the first uh, participant in the Bitcoin, gold, gun, silver, ammo, and there's gonna be more stuff. I'll get to that in a minute. Exchange, but we're gonna stick with the guns. Whoever wants to uh, take part with 357s, I'm gonna give you a 50% dividend. What does that mean? Say the gun is worth thousand dollars all right i'm gonna add 50 percent to that so you get fifteen hundred dollars worth of purchasing power for that gun so anyone that sends me name brand only i am not taking any crazy stuff uh there is one 357 that's pretty cool uh the uh chippewa support it's actually the barrel shoots below it doesn't come out the top it actually comes below and it actually makes the recoil but that's a pretty pricey gun i think it's like 200 bucks so if you got that one that would be like an 1800 dollars deal for you so whoever wants to take part in this and once again uh you will not know where you can ship the gun i'm not putting that in the video because you need to talk to me before we do this we need to all be on the same sheet of paper okay cool so we're on the sheet of paper everybody's doing this and yes, so in this video of uh, rest of the month, if you've got a nice 357 revolver, because that's what it's going to be, and you want to take part in this 
wonderful disruptive money, then booyah, you got a 50% dividend on that. Okay, so let's move on to some other stuff that I am accepting in this disruptive money. That's why you have the disruptive money intro. I am accepting Mac products, Apple products. Essentially, any iPhone, iPhone 5S, iPhone 6, clearly, MacBook Air, iPad, 2012 and above. I'll accept those. And since I'm a Mac dude and I know how to move those pretty quickly, I will give you 25% dividend on those. So if the MacBook is worth $1,000, you will have $1,250 for his buying power. So if you could like snag something really cool or snag some on eBay and then flip that to me, you can make your money go long, long, long. Okay. <clears throat> now, another thing that I'm accepting, and this is really for the upper end stuff and for the higher end products I offer, I'm going to accept watches. Now, I'm not going to accept um, what you get at the barbershop. I will accept very nice Chopert, Concord, Omegas. It doesn't matter if it's running or not. As long as it's a legit watch, I will take it. Doesn't matter if it's running. So if you got a nice Rolex that's real, whether it's running or not, I'll still take it. And then we will parse that out because I've got a watch guy. So I'm going to give you a website at the end of this video where you can go look up because <laughs> there are many people that just know Rolex. They don't know uh, Angs. I don't know if I'm saying the right Angs and Song. Uh, there's Philip Fatigue. There, there's a lot of high end watch brands. Frank Mueller, which is my favorite. If you can get me a Frank Mueller crazy hours, oh my goodness. I'll give you um, give you 100% dividend on that. If you can come up with a nice Frank Mueller watch, 100%. So if the watch is $3,000, you get $6,000 worth. Uh, yeah, I'll give you a $3,000 dividend. So why am I speaking in dividends? Because this is disruptive money. Uh, as I'm doing in my course, the Disruptive Circus, Disruptive Money. Now, the first part is we're going to talk about how to handle what you already have coming in. Then we're going to get to this other stuff because essentially there's going to be some serious, serious lessons coming in Disruptive Money. So at the end of the video, there will be a screenshot website. Go there. Just check out. And you may have some of this stuff laying around. So what does this mean? If you're willing to hustle and you don't have cash, you could go out and get, say, $500 worth of gold for maybe 100 bucks. Flip that to me and get yourself some awesome educational materials. This is disruptive money. So this is something I'm really excited about. I'm going to give it a year. So this is, yeah, this program's in effect for a year. And then I'll just hit everyone out, let you know what's going on. So from the top, Bitcoin, I'll get that set up probably by tomorrow. Guns. $550, $600 threshold because of transfer fees. And once again, I'm paying those. So whatever transfer fee you have on your end, just send me a receipt and then I'll add that on top of what you get. So what that means is if you send me a $600 gun and you pay a $50 transfer fee, then you have $650 worth of buying credit. Got it? Got it. Okay. Mac products, Apple products, 2012 and above. Also, uh, once again, another bonus. If you can get me 17 inch 2011, 2012, I'll, I'll go back on that. i7 chip, 8 to 16 gigabytes. That's going to be close to a $2,000, $1,500 to $2,000 machine. I'll give you 100% dividend on that. So, whatever you get, if it's worth, say, $2,000, then you got a $4,000 dividend. You know buying power now how do we come up with values gunbroker.com i'll accept those values that you see there and for the mac products apple products just go to ebay go to completed listing and whatever that and actually that's more money because i'll go with that because there'll be some that'll be a little inflated and i won't even dicker about the insurance so as long as we agree and that's why you got to email amy and say hey i got this i want to change this exchange this blah 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 and I'm open to other offers since this is disruptive money because I've dealt with a lot of stuff. I flipped a lot of stuff and it's like, hey, let's see what's going to happen. Just throw it out there and see what goes on. So that's what's going on. That's how we're going to do it. Uh, some points of interest for you. 
if you're going to deal with the gold, you need to get a scale. You can get one really cheaply at Target or Walmart. It's not going to cost you a lot. You can actually get one off Amazon because you're going to need a scale. Because what I want you to do is to send me a picture of the gold that you have in grams, what you're selling. And take a picture on the scale so the weight, because when I get it, I'm going to weigh it. <laughs> I'm going to test it. I'm going I'm to do everything I need to do. And then once I do that, you will get an email from me with, bam, this is what you got. This is what you're working with. This is how much you can buy. This is what you can buy and all that. Plus a little bit more because I think this is kind of cool. Now, uh, before I get that question, am I going to deal with diamonds? I would only deal with diamonds and you can get me a real appraisal. Now, understand, I've got people to appraise stuff. So, you know, you can send me whatever and say whatever. I've got people I've dealt with for years. I will take say an engagement ring of like 5000 above. That's the threshold. It's pretty much the only diamond I'll take. I may take some estate jewelry, some antique stuff like that. No costume jewelry, unless you can send me 100 pounds. I'm not really interested in that. So, yeah. I don't, like I said, if you've got something of value and you want to offer it and it's something you can ship, we can talk. Just say, boom. And all right, send Amy at amy at hustlersfood.com a picture of whatever you have. To send a picture and say, hey, you know, I want to exchange this. I want to exchange that. And we can sit down and talk about it. Or we can email about it. Or you can talk to Amy. And that's how that works. All right. So in the comments, if you made it this far, tell me what the hell do you think of disruptive money? Bitcoin, gold, guns, silver. Oh, silver? Morgan silver dollars. Love those. And like I said, if you can go ahead and like get a discount, just go to the flea market. Uh, you can go to a flea market and you can have somebody with, say, you know, you want to buy something from me, like, say, a consult, which is seven fifty, um, and say you get, you spend four fifty for seven hundred and fifty or eight hundred dollars worth of gold, and you can do this. I'll accept it. I'll give you that. I'll give you that. So there's ways that you can hustle your way into a very good situation. And that's part of disruptive money. That's part of the disruptive circus. That's part of the disruptive economy. Because if you really, really look at this, there's a, there's an opportunity. So once again, in the comments, just tell me how you feel. Let me know. And, and if any of those legal internet lawyers come in and like, you can't do that. Just bitch slap them. Just in the comments, just bitch slap them. Just thump them away. Because also, if don't believe me, just do the research. Talk to your gun dealer and they're going to say, yeah, you know, if you want to ship a gun, I, with my license, can ship to this licensed dealer and it's all cool and it's legit. Now, if you're in the state of Georgia and you want to wheel and deal, hey, just uh, send me Amy an email and we could talk about it because there's a lot is gun laws here are just totally different than other places. There's a lot more that we can do here that you can't do in other states. New Jersey riding around with a gun, you go to jail crazy just crazy but yeah so if you're local you want a horse trade go and also with the gold stuff same deal you want to do that we can do that and we can make it happen so welcome to disruptive money this is going to be very very interesting year so it is february 22nd so we're going to do this until february 22nd 2016 see how that goes I just think that it's probably going to catch fire because once I start really horse trading, it's going to be interesting. All right. This is Glennon. Leave a comment in the comments. What do you think about disruptive money? And I will see you on the good side or in the Hustler Mindset Project.